WattCycle offered to send me their 30 amp MPPT charge controller for testing. Okay, here's my test setup. I've got the 30 amp MPPT on a board here temporarily, and we have some cables that I found that are going over to the battery bank. This is a 12 volt system. I have connected the positive and negative cables from the 1200 watts of solar panels outside my solar workshop. I've only put in 200 watt hours through this charge controller so far. So I need to run it a bit longer to see how it's going to behave. Okay, it's been about an hour. Let's look at the charge current. 29.6 amps. It goes a little over 30 amps sometimes, just a little bit. The temperature is 45 degrees Celsius, and that isn't too bad. It's the end of the day, and I've put in 1.47 kilowatt hours. It's been a really bad day today for solar. The sun is in and out, so I'm just going to continue the testing tomorrow. Okay, it's the end of the next day of testing, and I've put about 2 kilowatt hours through this charge controller. I can feel the heat coming off of it. The heat sink is about 52 Celsius, and let's change it to Fahrenheit real quick. 126 degrees on the heat sink on the back, and 68 degrees ambient inside the room. Um, however, it's not stopping it from working. It still works. 47 Celsius on the internal. So that doesn't quite match what I'm seeing on the heat sink, but uh, I'm not terribly worried about it. I know if I mounted this in a vertical position the way it's supposed to be, there'd be a little bit better cooling because of the convection effect. So I haven't seen it really go over 30 amps, not by much, so I think the build quality is pretty solid.